It's blue, one of it. <laughs> welcome back to my channel, guys. And if you are new, welcome to my channel. If you have not subscribed, which most of you haven't, because I have seven subscribers and one of them is me, please go ahead, subscribe in the down bar there, hit the little bell notification, and join the family. Uh, I don't have a family yet, but we will. We'll get there. Like the video, comment below what you want to see next. And we've got a special guest today. Maddie! So, this is my best friend, which I have told you about if she... This is going to be a little trivia. Have you watched my last video? I have not watched it, no. I, I'm a really bad friend, guys. Sorry. I told them the story. Oh, can I mean, like I said, I mean, we're not going to see. This, this is the girl that made me wet myself in the street. Doing exactly this. Um, so basically, today's video, I am in my pajamas. Maddie has just gotten back from work. I have my hair up in a ponytail and no makeup on whatsoever. And we decided we're going to do something that we were talking about. And we thought, you know what, this needs to be on camera because basically, this is Basically, we realized we're, we're old. really old. So old. Like, I'm 23. Yeah, 24, not much older, but we're old. old. So, old to the point where we don't understand what young people are talking about. There are words on the internet, like on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and we look at them and we're like, what, is what are you saying? Mean? What do you mean? What are you saying? So, today, we've written down some words. And we're going to Google them. And we're going to tell you what we think they are. And then we're what they actually are. The first one, we've already Googled, um, yeet. Yeet. So I, when I first saw this word, I thought this word was meaning like yeast. And I was like, why do you have an infection? Why are you talking about that? Why? Did you mean to spell feet? Did you mean to spell feet? Like, wh what is it? What, what does, does it, what mean? it mean? And it's just random. It's at the end of every sentence. It's just why? randomly there. Like, and why? People are like, I am so yeeting. Yeeting for what? Yeeting for what? Don't mind my cat. That's Louie. Yeah, you'll see him. But, that. so, we googled it. What did we think it was? I, oh, legit, you I thought. You just thought it was someone having a yeast infection. I kind of thought, is it our age group's version of yes? And we've done some Googles. Basically is. It basically is. So, it's, instead of yes, it's yeet. It, um, it says... In future, you will yeet. In the present, you are yeeting. And in the past, you yoat. And it's often used to express the word yes. So basically, it's our version of yas. Why don't you just say yas? Why don't you just say move, like stick with our generation? Why At least create, you have the proper word. Why create new words? I don't know. So what? the next one that we saw and we've written down is stan. Now, I see this on, like, Twitter a lot. Like, a lot on Twitter. So, it'll just be one random text that's like, we stand. And I'm like, okay, well, that one, I'm like, maybe it's like, we stand up for something. And you just haven't mentioned what that something is. I just naturally assume they're talking about stan, like, Netflix rivals. And that's what I thought it was. Google. Stan means you look up to that person or you truly love their content. It's another word for saying I idolize it, idolize them. Basically, kids are saying I stan instead of I love. Just, just, just. Maddie, say, just I say, stan you. Just say I love. Is it because the L word's a little bit too, like, commitment? But if you're talking about Channing Tatum's abs, why wouldn't you just say you love them? Yeah, why say I stan Channing Tatum's abs? Just say love or like like. Yeah. Ugh. What's the next one? This is as far as we got up to talking before we decided to make Now this video. one I a hundred percent know what it is. It has to be. There's no other way it can be anything else. Gucci. Oh Gucci gang, Gucci gang, Gucci gang. So it's it's gonna be the brand. It's these ones I think is we Gucci. Like so it has to be like I actually With know what this one means. I don't, so this I think one, it's just the brand. This one's different to me because I actually know what this means. Huh. It means I'm good, I'm chill, I'm Gucci. Like, I'm good. I'm Gucci. No, I'm Gucci. That's stupid. It because, it's because Gucci represents rich and ballin'. 
So it means you're good, you're cool, you're just pimping. So you're right. half right, like it does come from Gucci. The brand, yeah. But it just means like you're good, you're chill. Skirt. Skirt. Like S -K. I don't know. U R T. Oh, skirt. That what? Caleb uses this one all the time. See, so you even know how to say it. I, it's a skirt. Like you can get I, my wasted pencil skirts. Caleb like. says this all the time, and now it totally makes sense what he says. It means to bounce, like to leave. Next one, ready? What's next? I think I know what this one means as well. Clout. Fish. Clout. Clout. C L O U T. Clout. It's a fish. Clout. It is fish. It is, it is a fish. It is about being famous and having an influence. Not a fish? No, it's an angular fish. Wow, Rice, Mitch, and Bangs have hella clout. That's the. I don't understand that sentence. <laughs> Yeah, we finna. don't know that one. Finna. 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 Do you know what finna means? Do you know what finna means? Oh my god. What? It means fixing to or going to. Just say going to or gonna. Like. Oh, is it like a just different word for gonna? Remember how I was like that example of a finna go to the movies with that jacket? Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, go to the, the movies. movies with that. That's so stupid. G and O are really right, right next, right to, next to it. And I. Literally. Stay woke. Is that just meaning like stay, stay awake? awake? That's what I think. Is it just stay awake? Stay awake. It has to be just stay awake. Oh, it means like shit is gonna go down. Oh, so like stay woke. Shit's happening. It says, driving from stay awake to stay woke is to keep informed of the shitstorm that's going oh, around. Oh, so like stay away of. No, stay awake, like stay awake is to stay woke is to keep informed of the shitstorm that's about to occur. So just mean like keep an eye because shit's going on. Well then. So guys, uh, I am now editing this and realized I don't actually have an outro for this uh, video and I'm super sorry. This is going to be such like cut start cut start kind of video because i tried filming this video like a week ago hated it and then started having a conversation with maddie um loved it and then my battery died and then i lost my adapter and then it's just been crazy so i'm now editing it now hence the whole like crazy crazy hair hoodie no makeup terrible lighting i'm in my i'm like i'm in my wardrobe so thought i would just end the video here um so if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below, hit that little bell icon, and yeah, peace.
Louis, you don't want to know. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna stop.